reworked your repulsors with some of the parts I salvaged from their old engine. Should fix that stabilization problem you had. Come on, Rover. It'll work. Commander! Getting our tech to talk to theirs is harder than you'd think. Lily Shen, Chief Engineer. At your service. You were probably expecting to see my father. In all that's happened, I'm guessing Central didn't tell you yet. He's gone. Dad gave everything he had to get us this far. This entire ship is his life's work. I know he would have loved to show you around the place himself. He used to talk about you a lot. You can be sure I'm ready to finish what he started. Might not look it, but from here, I can fabricate pretty much anything you come up with. And with a little more help, well, you'd be amazed with what I can do. It was an honor to finally meet you, Commander. I can't promise any miracles, Commander, but I should be able to put some of the stuff together in no time at all. I'd suggest we get started with a med kit. It'll probably come in handy sooner rather than later. I'm on it, Commander. Looks like Tygen has made progress on his research. We should meet him in the lab. So much of my own research based upon this simple design. If only I had known. Ah, Commander, excellent timing. There's been some progress. I've managed to break down several key components of the chip implanted into your skull. My analysis reveals that its primary function was that of a conduit, passing a vast amount of data directly to your cerebral cortex. With the primary connection severed, much of that data is lost. Several fragments do remain, however. Uh, ghosts, if you will. Observe. Tactical combat simulations. War games. The sheer volume of encounters you were processing was astounding. It... It is truly remarkable that you survived as long as you did. Though this may seem disconcerting, there is still some good news. This chip bears a striking resemblance to a medical implant I briefly assisted in developing at the Gene Therapy Clinic in New Providence. My understanding was that the implants were intended for high-ranking Advent officers only, captains or above. Retrieving a chip from such an officer would be the only way to know for certain. A greater understanding of these implants would undoubtedly benefit us all, Commander. New objective added. The Advent officers have clearly been modified to allow for their subordinates to receive new orders psionically. The implanted chip is the key. I do find that area of research to be among the more intriguing options available. We'll begin work immediately. I'll send word when a complete report is available. Looks like Shen got that converter up and running, Commander. We're ready for you on the bridge. efforts. There are still people who refuse to believe their lies, and it's time we let them know they're not alone. We've already located a target for our first operation. Sir, given our current location, there's actually no way the Sky Ranger could reach that position. Who said anything about the Sky Ranger? Shen, status report. Are we ready? Short answer? Yes. But you might all want to hold on to something.
course for the Arctic. We're ready to start making moves, Commander. By hitting Advent wherever we find them, we can help strengthen the resistance. In return, they'll contribute material and personnel to support our operations. Commander, it looks like Shen prepped a med kit for us. We should equip one of our soldiers with it before they deploy. Secure the area. Expect hostile resistance. No need to ask twice. Hostile forces spotted.
Heading out. I've got eyes on an advent position.
entirely locked down. We're running out of time. Get to that terminal. Secure the data. Closing on target position now. We're near the objective. Commander, we have confirmation of the exposed access point.
success in the field is good for the entire crew's morale. equipment and debris from the ship to make room for new facilities.